Hello everyone, welcome back. It's Michael Lamb, your host of the Batteries Review. Now, um, I'm going to taste a really unusual beer with you today. And this beer is from Scotland and that's why I'm wearing my Scottish scarf. Uh, this is a beer uh, that is spiced with heather. Heather, okay, so it's everywhere in Scotland you go to um, the Scottish Highland and the Lowland you see a lot of heather. Now, this particular beer is called Frosch, uh, Froch, Frosch, uh, I'm not sure about my pronunciation. Ah, what the heck? Uh, it's brewed by the William Brothers Brewing Company, and this company is famous for. Um, brewing a lot of really old-fashioned, old-style traditional recipes. And here it says that Froch is Scotland's native ale. Froch is Gaelic or Gaelic for heather. Heather ale has been brewed in Scotland for 4,000 years and is the oldest style of, uh, of ale still made in the world. And it talks about the pigs and all that and they brewed beer in the past. So most beer are brewed uh, and spiced by hop and uh, you know the finish we use some juniper berries to uh, spice the beer and here we have a beer which is um, spiced and preserved by Heather. On the nose the first thing is um, dry flour heatherly honey 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 and, and heather. with malt. Um, the color is kind of bronze and it's uh, uh, very um, very dirty and yeah, very opaque. That means I think the beer is, is good because these beers are probably unfiltered. Surprisingly good. I wasn't expecting a beer to be that balanced. That Heather um, flowery taste, that dry flowery taste um, actually blend in with the malt quite well um, and it's a uh, it's a little uh, herbal, herbal in the sense of uh, sweet herbal sweetness um, it's got almost a little hint of uh, Chinese medicinal taste but all in all it's good it's much better than what I thought when I got a bottle of this beer I thought it would be pretty weird but um, no wonder the pigs were such great fighters because they must have drunk gallons and gallons of this stuff well thanks for watching it's a surprisingly uh, interesting 